Well, hello and welcome. I want to say thanks for clicking on the video. So this is Nate. Now we're going to start the day off right. Yep. This is the very first one of the day. We'll get you a really nice treat here. 2,280 square feet. Three bedroom, two bath. Nice wraparound porch. This one is uh, made by Franklin Homes. And I am here at Pratt Homes in Tyler, Texas. I want to say thank you to letting me come film the homes here. And trust me, y'all are going to really like this one. I will say this is the very first Franklin home that I have ever filmed. And after looking at the homes they got here, I'm really impressed with their homes. So uh, I hope you all enjoy. Stick around to the end for some price information, of course, and check the link in the description. There'll be more information on this home and with the link. So I hope you all enjoy. I know once we get inside, the fit and finish of this stuff, you're going to love it. It's got all hickory cabinets, LVP flooring all the way through. I mean, it's like, it's it's right there. So you've got an all glass door right here. Let's come up take a look at it real quick. Now that could be your front door. Or you could use the door that we're going to go in is your front door. We got to check out your porch here a little bit. I tell you what, right here in the sun, it feels really good. It's only, what is it, about 55 degrees outside right now, but it's supposed to get back up into the 70s. This is in January, so it's kind of nice to have some warm weather. Not the freezing temperatures back home. Now we're inside, I'll show you this uh, double door right here. Now you can get either a sliding glass door, the French doors, or the double doors that you have there. You do have the blinds built in, into the full glass there. Really nice, especially if you got pets, then they can't mess with the blinds. Look at the size of this living area. All your vents are in the ceiling. This is a huge living area. Off your living area comes into the dining room. And let me tell you, that large four man table looks small in here in comparison to the full size of the dining room. And check out this light fixture. And then we've got the kitchen over here with your extra long butcher top styled 
countertops here. Now this is like your linoleum or formica type deal, but it, uh, I love the way it looks like a butcher top with the farmhouse stainless steel sink. Now this is divided into two. You can get the single sink in there. And they went with the LG stainless steel appliances in here. And we've got soft closed doors and drawers. Got the tray ceiling in here. Now these are already really, really tall ceilings. My guess is nine foot and then with that, it's gonna be 10 foot in the tray. It's a pretty tall ceiling. And over here, of course, they don't need the heater. It's plenty warm right now. Like I couldn't have picked a better time to come down here for being January and still being in the 70s. Kind of nice break to get away from the cold at home in Montana. Looks like we've got some pots and pans drawers right here, right next to your stove. What do we got? Oh, well, that's all one big door, okay. <laughs> I thought maybe we had two separate, or like four separate doors there. Had to check it out. And over here you've got your pantry cabinet. Off your kitchen is going to be your utility room. So you got your nice side by side, you know, set up there. And then you got some cabinets up above. We've got our water heater right here, so not in a closet. Really nice to see. Lots of room for a freezer right there. And we're going to go kids' bedroom. The lights went out. <laughs> it's bright enough, I don't really need them anyway. So that mailbox that you saw when we came in, that mailbox has a little timer deal in it that you turn to turn the lights on. And I, evidently I didn't give myself enough time. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go out and turn them back on because I can see out once I get inside of the bedrooms, it's gonna get dark again. All right, so now we got the bathroom. Got the square porcelain sink. Got the shiplap back on backing on the wind or window. Yeah, not a window. That's your mirror. Really nice looking. Lots of counter space at the end down there. We've got four drawers. And check out the size of this tub. Of course, it's a one piece shower tub combo. And look at how big that crown molding is up there, all the way throughout the whole home. In your second bedroom. Now I know you guys have already seen some pictures of what's to come in the bathroom, but just let me tell you, that master bathroom, you're going to want to stick around and check that out. So 
So now we're going to head back this way. And in here is our furnace or unit for the central heating and air, whichever you want to call it. So then we have our desk area. Nice set of cabinets up above. I mean, this would be a good little office space, place the kid to come do his homework or whatever. Really nice office space back here. Of course, my monitor's not going to fit. It's too big to fit underneath that counter there, or that cabinet. And we have a coat closet back here. And going into our master bedroom. Now comparison wise, give you a clue as to how wide it is. Of course, you already know I'm going to have measurements there. That is a king size bed. And just look at how much space you have in your bedroom still with a king size bed. And a big old dresser over there. Okay, so if you guys are at Pratt Homes, you guys should ask for either Blaine Noble or Chase Van Zura. Uh, those two guys were really helpful. I'll throw up a card up on the screen here real quick. You know, if you go in there, ask for them too. They were real helpful in uh, getting information for me. They'll be real helpful in getting information for you and uh, probably hook you up with a really good deal. So uh, once again, it's Blaine Noble and Chase Van Zura. So uh, ask for them too. If you're in the Tyler, Texas area and you're looking at a home at Pratt Homes, these two are the guys to go see. All right, before we get too long in here, I guess we better get to, get to the bathroom itself. Of course now, can't really hide the shower there. You, plain sight when you come in, but you got this really nice floating tub here. And you got the blinds in the window so you can flip the blinds up so nobody can see in and still get lots of light coming in. We're going to come back to the shower there. Hello Raiden. And look how much cabinet space you have in this cabinet here, below your sinks. Lots and lots of drawers. Some really nice brushed nickel on the uh, faucets here, and that was throughout the whole home. In our water closet. Now wait till you check out the tile in this shower. Love that river rock inlay there. They did the same thing on the floor. And yes, you have a really nice bench in here with some more river rock inlay. You got the dual shower heads, individual handles. Looks really nice. I really like the way they did that one. All right, we can't forget the closet. So we've got a large walk-in closet. And with that, this being my first Franklin home, if you haven't left a comment before, you should leave your very first comment down below. Let me know what you think.
Of course, if you've left a comment before, feel free to keep on leaving them. The more you comment, the better the YouTube thinks the video is doing. The more people like it, the better YouTube promotes it. So hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, turn on the notifications. That way you get notified when I upload videos. Thanks for watching. And I will have some price information here in a little bit. All right, well, I hope you all enjoyed the video. So this was a 2,280 square foot home called the Torridon, three bedroom, two bath. So a really nice home. Um, so there are lots of options in this home, but now we got to get into some price information. Now Pratt Homes did not provide me with an actual price on the home. So what they provided me with is a range of price per square foot. Now this one is a modular, so this one will come in at a little bit more than say a manufactured. Okay, and so this is a Franklin home, and as we guys know, Franklin homes are a little bit on the upper end, spendier side, so keep that in mind along with the price information that this is at time of filming in January of 2023. This is at Pratt Homes in Tyler, Texas, so a lot of things could affect this depending on where you have it delivered, set up, that kind of stuff, depending on the options that you get. And that's what this range is that I have, is depending on options, setup, things like that. So as a modular, there's also a crane involved, so you got to keep all that kind of stuff in mind. But this one starts at about $120 a square foot, goes all the way up to $160 a square foot. So keeping that kind of stuff in mind, you know, but I wanted to give you about the best price information that I could, and that's what they were willing to provide to me. Because as it specifically states on their website, which I'll also have scrolling up and down a little bit, their website uh, states that no two houses are generally built the same way the show, the show model is. So they didn't want to give me a price based off of the show model because, as they said, no two houses are built the same. But thanks for watching. Hope you all are hitting the subscribe button, the like button, the notification bell, all that good stuff. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.